Hi everyone! Happy Sunday! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing my monthly spread layout uh, with you guys and uh, also opening up my first subscription from a glam planner. I am so excited. Um, I, I was kind of debating whether or not I wanted to get this because I... Uh, it's hard because I, I usually have my own kind of themes in mind so but with this subscription it's kind of it's a surprise basically so I'm subscribed every month and uh, so my monthly kit will come usually about the first within the first three days of uh, the month that it's for so that I can plan and it's a total surprise so which is kind of unlike me but um, I thought I would give it a try and see because I love 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 her spreads I use her sticker kits for my week-to-week -week ones and um, she's got such a beautiful design and beautiful colors that I, I thought I would trust her and uh, just sign up for this mystery monthly kit and uh, see what what I get I think I also signed up for the teeny subscription as well so there's like some special um, I guess designs or themes that these teenies are supposed to be that are not available in her shop to everybody else so let's see what August looks like so I'm taking open here and open this up there we go drum roll please da, da, da. let's take a look oh oh wow oh that's beautiful Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm going to take the plastic off before I, I open it for you guys. And then we have some teenies as well. So that's the teeny sub and August. And that's all that I got from this order anyway. So these are going to come once a month, every month, unless I cancel my subscription, which honestly, now even just having seen the first one, I don't think that I will. Um, so let's open this oh. Oh, look at these glitter overlays. I'm dying. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, wow. Oh, that's gorgeous. Okay, so how she normally, because I've watched some of her videos, that's what kind of inspired me to kind of do this. Um, she makes these here. Oh, look how gorgeous. Oh, it's like a scene. It's a beautiful scene. So the idea behind these are that these are transparent and then they go on top of the uh, of these you'll see when I when I design it and then um, I guess drink the wild air which is beautiful and then you put these look at that gorgeous put these guys over these that's what I that's what I understood from her video anyway so if you can see here kind of goes over there and we'll go over the color. So let's just see what's included here. So we have this page, which is gorgeous, like a little cabana on the beach. I love the colors. It's so beautiful. It's like a purpley, bluish pink, like dusk and sunset with the palm trees. Oh, this isn't summer vibes, guys. I don't know what is, honestly. And then I do like this as well. Um, she includes two different options for that, this, the full sidebar. So you can either have your lists here or you can just have another uh, deco and then the month, the next month as well. She includes that at the bottom. So, ooh, this is so hard. I don't know which one I'm going to decide yet. We'll see how everything looks when I put it together and then I will decide. And then these are the bills, to-do, goals, Important next month, date covers, paydays, some plain flags, quarter boxes, and um, like little ones for her deco, which is right here. So the idea with these is that, so what I was doing before with other kits is that I would take these and put them onto the squares, but she's actually created her kits so that you can actually take these circles and there's actually a circular spot for them in here and they fit perfectly in there. So I'm really excited to try that out. I haven't done that yet before and then this is the rest of the kit to cover up the days that are not August oh it's beautiful I think it's like a bird of paradise or orchids or some sort of beautiful tropical flowers I love it I really want to be on a beach just looking at this this kit makes me so happy <laughs> so and then these are my little teenies which are so cute oh <gasps> Is, this one is let me see this one is oh the girls are eating hot dogs 
which is kind of awesome because for anybody who knows me, I love hot dogs. I'm not a, I'm not a burger girl, so it's kind of funny that <laughs> the teenagers will be having hot dogs because that's pretty much the only barbecue food that I eat. Um, my husband's a burger fan, so we'll always have both at the table. But And you kind of get one of each of the teeny girls. Lolly's usually my girl, but I can still use probably Bippity and Boo, and I'll just maybe keep these guys for next summer. And then this is, oh, this is Happy Mail. So cute. So the girls are holding up their ginormous package because, honestly, that's probably... How many stickers did I order? My packages are huge like that when I get them because I can never have too many. So those are the girls with their happy mail. And then this one. Huh. This one. I'm just sorry. I'm just trying to figure it I think. I think this is the teeny girls sitting in a tube in the pool and like they're wearing a hat maybe. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. That's what it looks like to me anyway. It looks like they're they're kind of floating on a, a pool tube, like one of those little rings, and then you're kind of looking on top of them with their hats on, I guess. I don't know. That's what it looks like to me. But anyways, that's super cute too. So, if, you know, for any pool days or if you go to the cottage and you're relaxing, you can use these guys to celebrate. Um, okay, so I'm going to grab my planner and uh, let's get started. All right, so this is what my planner looks like. Um, my month, month at a glance before I get started, I just use some sticky tape or sticky notes to mark the really important things that I want to keep track of that month. And then I knew I was going to be getting a sidebar with this kit, so I also included a couple things that I want to work on this month or things that I need to do. And um, let's start laying down some stickers. So with her hers, I really like this part too, is that I don't like to see the month before. Some people do, so it's totally up to you. I mean, you don't have to use that if you don't want to, but I like it that she offers stickers to block this out so that you can just focus on the month that you're working on. That's how I like to plan as well. That's why this is such a good fit for me. So you'll see here that when she, you have the Monday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, it's actually kind of like a double box and it's going to cover up the whole that whole area which is really nice so I'm going to take off the top stickers just throw those up there don't mind my little casual sweatshirt guys we've got these cute little kitties on it because it's just kind of like a casual weekend we're not really doing too much just kind of staying in and relaxing and catching up on some house stuff so I thought I'll just be cozy it's also a little cooler um this weekend as well compared to what it's used usually is so i am going to flip my planner over for this part and i flipped it because i don't like the way the coils bug my hand so i do kind of flip my planner over in a bunch of weird positions so i apologize i hope you guys can still kind of follow along with me do you guys do that as well i feel like sometimes i'm planning and my planner is like upside down but it still makes sense so there we go I should have whited this out because it does show through, but I am actually don't have white out right now, so yeah, I'm kind of stuck, but I'm hoping that I haven't had a chance to run out to the store, actually. I wonder if I put this on here, if it will just cover it up, hopefully. Do I have anything written on this side? No, that's good. Okay. That's okay. Ideally, I would wipe this out because that would usually bother me, but I'm hoping when I put this on here that you can't really see it. So let's try and find out. That was on my list to get this week, and I just oh, I keep forgetting every time I go to the store. So let me just see if that will still show. Because this one, I feel like once you lay this down, that it's going to be kind of done. All right. Oh, sorry. Okay. I didn't realize, okay, so I didn't have white out, and this was bothering me so much. It was showing through. I was like, oh, my God, I don't want to go to the store in the middle of the video and get white out. So I just got creative, and I just had a little piece of, like, white cardstock kind of sitting around. So I just cut out a piece of white cardstock and slipped it underneath, and you can't even tell. So 
that is a little tip. <laughs> if you are in a pinch and you go to stand and plan, because let's face it, we're human. It happens sometimes. We forget to get white out or, you know, the kids take it and pull it off and ruin it, which happens sometimes too in my house. Um, my daughter loves it when she finds my white out and me not so much. So that's a little tip. You can just take a little piece of white paper, white cardstock, whatever you have handy, cut it out and just slip it underneath the sticker that you don't want it to show through and then voila, it looks a lot better. So I just, when I got back to the desk, I forgot to hit record. So sorry, that part was off camera. So now I have a little more freedom with where I want to put this guy because I don't have to worry about covering up anything. So I think I'm going to put it right in the middle of this little cabana thing here. And be very careful with the, the, the silver sticker because it doesn't pull up quite as nice. Like when you pull it up, it will start to pull up part of the design. So with the regular stickers, you can pull them up a couple times and they have like that kind of washy feel. Hers, all of her stickers are usually really easy to lay down and pull up. But with this one, just be careful because kind of once you lay it down, you, you kind of want to leave it there. But oh my God, that is so gorgeous. Yes, I love this so much already and I just started. So this is the first side. And then over here, we're going to do, where is my other one? Okay. So with this one, it's going to be here. Let me just check to see if these show through. I'm just checking to see if I need to get any more cardstock. No, that's okay. And again, I'm just going to kind of turn my runner sideways and cover up this little turquoise part here. And perfect. There we go. Awesome. All right, so that is that side. Oh, and then I forgot my, I was going to say it's a little more plain, but that's not true because we have our other quote to put down there, which is drink the wild air, which is kind of nice because this is our last, I feel like our last month of like fresh air until we get into the school season because at least for the summer the kids are able to go outside with their mask off like in the backyard and stuff like that and then we're all going to be masked up in September so drink the wild air is very very fitting for this month um I don't know if she had COVID in mind when she was designing this or if she, it was designed months before because I know a lot of these shops do design them like up like probably up to six months in advance sometimes so Regardless, it is very perfectly suited for this month, and I love the way that looks. And then I'm going to choose, there's two squares here that I want to cover, but I don't know which. And I like that she gives you some options. So you could do, so for this one, I'm going to open up my book so that I can kind of see in comparison like to the other side what will probably fit better. So I know I don't want to use this because... I feel like it's already plain here. I want to use a design, but do I want to use, I really like these flowers though. Honestly, they're gorgeous. I'm going to have to cut them probably. That's the only thing. Um, or I could do this one and the hat. I could do that as well. Tough choices. Um, I'm going to use my ridiculously oversized new rose gold scissors. <laughs> Got some weight to them, but I just try to decide. Actually, you know what? What I do sometimes, I don't know if you guys do this too, is that if I can't decide and I'm having trouble, and I know you can pull the stickers up and down, but, you know, that makes them less sticky and it can sometimes make your planner a mess. So sometimes what I do is I just kind of cut them. And then that way, what you can do is kind of see what it looks like without actually even laying it down. So we can see how the hat looks. Oh, it's okay. Or the flowers, which I will still have to cut. That looks okay too. Or I could do also this one here and the hat here. How does that look there? Yeah, I think I like this better than the flowers. I'll, I'll find a I'll find a home for these guys. I just I just don't like that like I just don't want to have to cut this tip part off because I, I like I like that it's longer. So if I don't use it here, I'll, I can use it somewhere else and maybe my um, planner or in one of my spreads in here for the summer. So I'm gonna hold on to these two for later and I am going to 
put these guys down. And just gonna make sure that looks good, perfect. And then with this one, I'm gonna have to, actually, I should probably should have laid it down and then I wouldn't have to worry about cutting it, but that's okay. Hopefully I just don't cut it too short. So basically right after the bottle. And then you, I can save this one for later or for something else. Put that in my pile over here. And this one is going to go right here beside the flowers. I may have cut this a little crooked. Yes, I did. All right, guys, this is part of the process. It's lining everything up. There we go. It's a little longer here, but that's fine. I'm not going to get too crazy here. So I'm just cleaning up my scissors there. And then next I'm going to decide on the sidebar, which I already know I'm going to have trouble with because they're both so beautiful. Uh, I want them both. Um, again, normally I would have this stuff like pre-cut for you guys, but I waited to, to open it on camera because I thought that would be more fun and exciting. You guys could see like my authentic reaction. I was so excited. I've been holding on to this for a week, guys, and I was like, do I open it? Do I not open it? So I've been waiting. So there, I can do this one. Or, because I already have the cabana here, I can do this which to be honest, I might do because I do have my list that I do like to include. So again, I'll keep this for another time. And I'm going to pull that there. And I'm just gonna match this with the top here. Beautiful. I love it. This is great. Okay, so that's what the sidebar looks like. You have your next month, and that's that. So now I'm going to put down all my important stuff. Um, nope, that's a lie. Actually, first I'm going to go ahead and put down all the dates, and I'll be right back. All right, so all the date covers are on. Next, I am going to be marking my paydays, which are going to be on, they've actually just recently switched. They used to be on Thursday, and now they're gonna be on these two Tuesdays. So, but there are four paydays included in case you get paid every week. I get paid every other week. So, I'm just trying to see what colors I'm going to use. Um, this one I'm going to use here. Payday. And then this one I'm going to use the light pink. I'm just trying not to get too many colors of the same color in one area. And then, oh, on the sidebar, I forgot to put in these little things, I guess. So what are we going to do? We're going to have to do... going to be one of them so to do you can put your own in here too if you want um, important and we'll do as well goals I'm not really gonna do the next month just because I, I just want to focus on this month right now and see what I want to do for August and then you have two left over you have bills and next month bills you can keep track of here, but I'm going to be keeping track of them in my planner, so I don't really need these ones to, to use for that. So I'm going to put those off aside. So those are done. Um, my son has karate. Uh, that has also changed <laughs> with COVID, so he now has it on Mondays and Wednesdays from 6 to 6.45. And how I'm going to be marking that is just with one of these icons, just because... Well, she doesn't have a karate icon in here because how could she, right? Like everybody's kids and everybody has so many different things going on. So, I mean, she does have a really great selection of things to use every month, which I really like. Um, but sometimes you're just going to have stuff that's personal to you. So for his karate, 
Um, I'm probably going to use maybe this like maybe yellow I'll use for him. I'm going to use yellow. So I'm just going to put on every Monday and Wednesday. I'm going to put a star and then I'll write in the time later. Um, his Karate Dojo has actually been amazing at, um, sorry guys, I'm slanted again, at like doing social distancing and, you know, following all the guidelines. Like we feel safe uh, bringing him there. All the kids have to wear masks to go in and then they go in one at a time. We drop them off at the door. We're not allowed inside. So they keep track of how many people are in there. They're at reduced class sizes and also very spread out on the mat like maybe five people a class or 10 now i'm not sure but their gym is huge they're all spread out on mats and then on the mats they have like these little squares um that they have to do their stuff in so they're not allowed to leave that square and all the kids have been really compliant which is awesome and uh, the teachers take videos and post them to us so we can still kind of keep track of how the kids are doing and see their progress and that sort of thing and uh, my son loves it. He's really happy to be seeing his friends again. And soon he's going to be, as soon as they're allowed, he's going to be testing for his orange belt, which we are super excited. He actually was scheduled to get tested, before, like literally the weekend that everything shut down. But then obviously we had to rebook it. So he's been waiting to test for orange for a while and he is ready. So I'm hoping for him that uh, they can get that rebooked for him soon. Um, these guys, sorry, I'm just moving some around. I'm going to move those aside for now. I'm not going to be using any of those with this spread. Um, okay, so what is next? The next one I think I'm going to do are my bills. So how many bills do we have? We have three bill dues, which is good because I have one, two, and three. So that's perfect. So three bill dues. I just have to decide what color I'm going to use. And I'm going to use turquoise up here. And light pink down here. Actually, no, that's a lie. I'm going to use the yellow there. There's like too much pink down here where I want to use it. So I'm going to use the yellow up here instead. And then I'm going to use the pink. Ooh, it's kind of a... That is a tiny, tiny square. Actually, I'm going to... I'm going to change things up, guys. Sorry. I'm actually not going to use these. But they lift up pretty easily, like I said. Um, so I am going to just like kind of stick them back in here so I can use them next time. I'm actually going to use these ones because I'm going to use the do in here and write down which one. I think, will this fit though? Let me just see. Sorry, guys. This is my first time using this, so you guys kind of get to learn how to use this with me. Yes, that will fit in there. So... We're going to mix it up. I'm going to use the smaller ones, though. So I'm going to use still the same colors. I'm going to use the turquoise up here. And the yellow was here. And the pink, dark pink, is going to be down here. And I'm actually going to move my son's karate thing for a moment. Just need that. Will it fit? Aha, it will. Okay, so you guys can use the smaller ones down here for the very bottom. And I'm just going to put his karate up there so that works. Um, and then I'm going to decide, I guess, which bill sticker to use. So I have more than one car payment. I actually have three car payments this month. So I only have two cars, so... One car there, one car here, and you know what, I'm actually going to put, I have end of the month bills also due on the 31st, so I'll just do the end of the month bills, and then I'll also write to myself that my car is also due, that way I can still include that, and then I'm going to put down these silver, um, overlay stickers and I'm actually going to zoom you guys in because I just realized you're pretty far up so let's see if you can kind of see better so 
There we go. So now it can be zoomed in, and I'm just going to put the overlay on. And the gold jewel is going to go right in the middle. Gorgeous. And that's what it looks like. Isn't that beautiful? So it's got some nice shimmer and overlay there. And then the next one I'm going to do is going to be my um, car payment down here. So again, I'm just going to do the same thing with the overlay. Put that just like that. These lay down so nicely and they're so beautiful. I love, 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 love these, these overlays that she's included with her, not just her monthly kits, but her actual kits too. I'll show you. I made one that I did earlier this month to show you what I mean with the hollow. It's so beautiful. I don't know. It just adds so much extra sparkle. It just makes me so happy to see a little bit more glitter, especially when you're paying bills. <laughs> should be, should be a happy event, right? Should be happy to, to look at that. So makes paying bills fun if that's possible. So there we go. So beautiful. And the next thing we have is our, so we have some medications to do for our dog, Harley. She's on, I think it's one is for flea and tick and one is for heart, heart medication. So um, I'll just do the one here in the middle. Do I have a dog sticker? I do. Yes, I have a little dog icon. So I'll do that one here. Very bottom. There we go. And this will be for Harley's meds. Oh, we only have oh, we only have three of those. Okay. Um so I guess we'll just do one of these then. That works as well. So, there, just put it on top. I'll, I'll do the writing on top because I think they were saying if you write underneath it, when you lay it down, it, it smears, which I don't want to happen. So the next one is going to be um, her flea and tick medication, which is going to be down here. I'm going to do yellow for that one. And I don't know if I have another dog one. I'm trying to see what we can use instead because there's a lot of different options here. Oh, this one could be. This could be like a medication. Perfect. So I'll use this little pill right here. And even though they don't have like the circle, you could still use them. It still works out nicely. So put this guy on. It's not too bad. We don't usually have two. This month we just happen to have two. Usually we just have the one a month. There's one that's one a month and one that's every three months. Um, so that is that. And then we have our anniversary, which is on the 9th. And we have been married for... I want to say seven seven years now. We've been together for nine. We've been married for seven years. And uh, so I'm very excited to be celebrating that this weekend. Um, I'm going to do like a more of a special design for this one. And we have two kids. I don't know if you guys know that. I know I may have mentioned them a couple of times, but uh, our, our daughter is going to be turning four in September and our son is going to be turning seven in November. We also have our dog, Harley, that you saw me put down her medication. Uh, and she just turned one, actually, last month. So, and she's a Burmese mountain dog. And um, she's our third child. <laughs> I'm just trying to see if there's anything else that I could use for that one. I am going to probably pull in... <laughs> this one is really big, though. I just... I had this for my other kit, but I also had some smaller ones. Okay. So I'm actually not going to, these are, it's just too big now that I look at it. Um, it looks a little bit too obnoxious, like this kid looks really delicate. So I might just use one of these instead. 
here's some little hollow stickers that I got from Sticker, uh, Scribble Prints Co. So I might just maybe do some of these. Do like cake maybe. Let me get this off. <laughs> and I'll just put that right here. And that's our doesn't really show up. It's a very, very slight hollow. It's not as sparkly as ours are, but it is a silvery. Oh, there we go. There's a little bit of it. You can see a little bit at the bottom there. And we already have the rings, so maybe we'll do the violin, which is kind of cute. I like that. Perfect. So we have our little music and our little cake there, and that's good for that. Tuesday uh, this week. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I have to go get blood work, which I hate. I hate, hate, hate doing. But I have a specialist with my uh, endocrinologist on the 26th, and I need to get my blood work done before I go to see him. I am currently in the process of waiting for results from an ultrasound that I had recently, and we're just trying to see if it looks, well, it looks suspicious, but they're trying to figure out whether or not they're going to biopsy, if if there is a need to biopsy it. So they, between those results and the blood work results, that will give us information on what the next step is when I see my doctor here. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna, that's gonna be fun. <laughs> I have to get that done this week. Oh, I totally forgot about that. That's why we have planners, guys. <laughs> and I'm going to use, actually, yeah, i use this one here. And, I only have like a needle one. Do I have a doctor one here? Um, I'm just trying to see. Looking for one where you're like crying. Because <laughs> I absolutely hate giving blood. There's a medical one. Okay, this is a medical one. See, she's got pretty much everything here. So there's a medical one. So I'm going to use the medical one for this day for my blood work. And we'll do the two overlays here. There's one there. And one more here. I'm a little nervous, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> um yeah. Hoping that uh everything is okay, but this has been kind of sitting on my mind for the past few weeks. I don't know if you guys have ever had any serious tests like that that you're you've had to wait to to find out the result for but it is not fun waiting let me tell you it's been a little little nerve-wracking I'm trying to be positive and uh, just you know hope for the best if it is anything the good news is that it's likely to be small but I'm still not still not super thrilled that it's there in the first place um, I'm kind of monitoring this nodule for like the past four years initially was a cyst and it's slowly gotten to be now solid and it's changing its characteristics. So they're just kind of wondering why. Um, also had a little note to put a loan sticker here. And this is my lolly book. So I have her all organized into different sections here. So I have like bath lolly, birthday lolly, date night, a whole bunch of things here. Um, I have like planning, phone calls, this kitty one's adorable and sleeping lolly but for this one i think i'm going to do so i had some samplers that i got from her in one of my other orders and i'm going to pick this one right here because that's kind of how i feel about this whole situation i'm just nervous and i'm anxious and i want to get it over with um just not knowing actually it honestly is part of the worst part because i feel like once i know at least we can deal with it and we can kind of get a game plan but not knowing is kind of stressing me out a little bit. So we're going to put Lolly right there because hoping for good news, but that's kind of, she fits in there with the colors. She's got like some blues and pinks and stuff. I think she goes with most of the kits actually, and I really love her a lot. So that side is all done. And then on here we have, and we are going to the cottage again uh, one more time. We usually go, um, twice in the summer. So I'm just trying to find, I know she has like a longer strip here that you can do for like 
days away. I'm just trying to see where that one is, where it's two squares long. This one? It's this one. Oh, okay. So we just have to like cut it to size. So we're going to be going to the cottage here. Um, I wonder actually, this would have been a good spot guys to use like my vacation stickers, but then I would still have to cut that. So it's okay. Um, I'm going to put this in the middle here because we won't be really doing anything else. And I'm just going to cut it to size with my gigantic scissors. There you go. So these two days, we're going to be leaving Friday, and then we're going to be coming back on the Sunday. So there we go. That's what it looks like. It's just like a little, little washi strip there. Um, and let's see. Um, what else? I have my car insurance payment, so I still have one more bill due. Um, so I will just do, do this one here, over here. That's going to be for my child care payment. And then, for like a benefit in Canada, I don't know if you guys have it. We have a little bit extra for the kids, which is really nice. Um, and I'm going to do one here, which is going to be pink. So this one is going to be money coming in. So I'm going to use a little dollar sign for that. And this one is going to be money coming out. So I don't have any more cars. So I'm going to use this little credit card, I guess, just so that I know that money is coming out and that's a bill due that day. And I have two more left of these, which is perfect. So I'm going to cover that one. And then cover this guy here. And I think that is everything. This is just to remind me that we have our garbage and recycling on a different day. All right, so I found the sticker that I wanted to use. It was just one of these guys here. So I'm going to do the dark pink. And just because we had a holiday um, in Canada this week, so normally our garbage day is on Thursday, and then we always put it out, but it's actually going to be one day late this week. So... And I'm actually going to use, this is uh, some leftover stickers that I had from another one of our kits. And I'm actually going to just use this script here so that we can remember to not put it out a day early, which is kind of, it's a lot of work. You get it all out and then you're like, oh, I got to bring it back. <laughs> but a lot of people on our street do it, so I don't feel too, too bad. So that is going to be trash night. Can I use any other ones, actually? Clean stuff, grocery shopping. So there's a couple of different things here, but I mean, I don't really know which days we're going to be doing that for the whole month yet. So I think that is everything, guys. Let me just open up my banner here. And zoom you guys out. So that's, that's what it looks like. So we've got the beautiful silver overlay. And we've got the sidebar got all my things written down and uh, yeah I might add a couple different things later maybe in some other uh, lolly lolly characters but I'm pretty happy with how this turned out so far and uh, she's got some really really beautiful kits uh, if you're not aware of her shop I definitely recommend checking her out it's glam planner I will leave the link for her shop and her Instagram down below I love all all of her kids. Um, so so excited to be part of the mystery monthly kit. I am definitely going to continue on. Uh, this is gorgeous and I could not have picked a better kit for this month. I am in love with this. And uh, if you guys just a quick little, the first two spreads of August, uh, the past two weeks. So this was my Little Mermaid kit. 
guys can see the hollow there, like the sparkles. I have, I have some videos on my Instagram too, so beautiful. There's just glitter everywhere, which made me so happy. So this was the thingamabob kit. And then this was for our anniversary week for this week. Um, I still haven't put everything in for this week. I kind of just did some back planning yesterday, but uh, I love this so much. I love the colors. I love the aesthetic. I love the design. Um, she, I just love her kits so much, honestly. They just really suit what I like in a kit very well. So this is kind of what this page looks like. And that was this page for our actual anniversary weekend. So I just decided to do like full deco for the weekend because we really didn't do too much. Um, kids are actually at the in-laws, God bless them. So we've actually had our first weekend alone since COVID uh, hit. And uh, so honestly, aside from doing this, we are just lounging around this weekend and enjoying some Peace and quiet while the grandparents enjoy the kids. They are the only family that we have been seeing uh, without a mask or like one household that you're allowed to mingle with and uh, we've been very careful with everything else so hopefully everything is okay. I hope all of you are staying safe right now um, and everybody is doing well and continues to do well uh, during this difficult time. I know we have some difficult decisions coming up in September with school and everything like that so thoughts are with with you guys and uh, with all of us because uh, we're still not through this and there is still uh, a little bit left to go so we'll get there guys we'll get there um, yeah so that's it make sure to hit like if you like this video and subscribe if you like my content I had a lot of fun opening this up for you guys and uh, decorating this and I look forward to seeing you next Sunday enjoy the rest of your weekend guys bye